NBL 1 West basketball game between the visiting Lakeside Lightning and your mentor Magic. My name's Aaron, I'm going to be your MC for the rest of the home games this season. I would like to start by an acknowledgement to country. I begin today by acknowledging the traditional custodians of the land on which we gather and pay my respects to our elders past and present. I extend that respect to Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islanders people here today. And now, an introduction of the team. Firstly, for the Lakeside Lightning, number one, William Patterson. Number two, Keanu Weaver. Number three, Nick Pileshi. Number four, Cameron Armstrong. Number five, Adam Nelson. Number six, Justin Bennett. Number eight, Ezekiel Grida. Number 10, Ben Lee. Number 11, Patrick Odingo. Number 12, Kieran Erbis. Number 30, Maya Duran. And number 34, Dominic Jackson. Head coach, Dave Lusro, with assistance, Zach Cuff and Jared Poole. And now, for your major magic, make some noise, number four, Byron Pearson. Number five, Tom Newsom. Number six, the captain and the monster man, Kyle Arnold. Number eight, as I mentioned, tonight is a very special milestone for one of our state's great basketball players. It is your captain's 250th state NBL 1 West game. I would like to welcome up one of his long-time long friends and coaches, Jerome McKay, to say a few words about him. Please welcome Jerome. Uh, it's... Uh, Everybody says these same coin words. It's an honour and a privilege. The honour and the privilege. Usually, you stand there and it's said to you. This time, you're saying to somebody else, where it is an absolute honour. And if you look at the dictionary, you look at the word honour, and you see a photo of Kyle in there, because that's how Kyle, how I feel him. This is a very emotional time, um, because Kyle, I've seen him as a gym rat at Wellington when he was this tall. He's now only about that tall. <laughs> But I was trying to think of words that I could cut short to, ex to describe Kyle as a person. Because all of you have seen Kyle as a player. Well, I think most of you have seen Kyle as a player and had the, the privilege of that. But the first thing that comes to mind, this from a young age, is courage. You know, you don't get people with the same level of courage as what he has. Skill, he has skill because he spent thousands of hours in a gym and honing his skills and having that desire and the last thing I thought was passion. Kyle played with a passion. And you know what? People with a passion make this world a better place. And Kyle has made the world a better place by being in it, not because of playing basketball. I'm sorry guys with my back. Not because of basketball, uh, not because of playing basketball, but because of the person that he is. And anybody that knows Kyle, he's infectious. You can't keep him down. I'm not sure the world's big enough for him. But believe me, he gives people an extreme amount of pleasure. And it really is my honour, Kyle, to give you this trophy and representing your 250 games. Thanks, Chuck. Uh, the boys are probably thinking, oh no, this guy can talk. We need to warm down now. Um, no, I want to first of all thank my family, um, playing in front of family and friends is, is what it's all about for me. Um, so thank you for your um, ongoing support and love. Uh, to the coaches, Joe, I've had, a, I've had a, a lot of special people put me under their wing and, and coaches and invest a lot of time, energy, um, love, tough love. Joe, I still remember when you cut me from the under-16 state team, that team won gold. But um, no, uh, yeah, thank you to all those coaches and then probably what I hold dearest, uh, my teammates. Uh, my first game was in 2006, so I've had a lot of, I've tried on a few jerseys and I've played for a lot of teams, so um, teammates of old and, and new, uh, there'll be no love lost tonight when the ball goes up, but I wish Lakeside all the best this season and, and looking forward to what we can build, so thank you everybody for coming out. Um, yeah, appreciate it.